And welcome to Garden F. There's the little sign. Now, Garden F is a bit, a bit of a unique garden. Let's find, show its quick, very notable feature, and that is the communal bamboo pea garden. Now, this is one of our little inventions here at Hedonesia. We realize that people pee. It's something that, you know, sometimes the uh, government officials might not recognize, but people do pee outside. And that there are plants that like pee. Bamboo is one of them. So what we've done here is made a little bamboo pea garden. Guys and girls can come here, have a little private spot right here in the corner of the property, and they can have a pea. And the pea actually is great for the bamboo. Pea also saves on the flushing, which is great, because every time someone does not use the toilet, that's another couple of gallons of water that we've now saved. The other thing about this garden, it's the continuation of the berm. And so one of the maintenance activities is to weed this area because, for instance, see how some of these coleus, they get so big. But then when they get big and you get rid of them out of the way, you can actually see that there's a crater on the other side. So that's, that's one of the nice things, to weed out this area to give a nice little view. This area here, this is where the sink drains into the kitchen sink. So you can see how dense the foliage, that's because it's getting a lot of nutrients in this area. Now, right now, as you can see, we haven't done much with this area. It used to be a pond that didn't work out. Now we're just thinking, and we're still in the thinking stage of what to put that's a succulent, decorative, or otherwise in this area that can really benefit from the um, the kitchen uh, drain, because you see the kitchen drain there, there's a pipe that runs all the way under. Now there's some coleus, and you can see an avocado tree, and some tea growing here. We like a few big plants in this area, because they kind of act as a break, because you can see here, here's the cliff. Now every now and then we get an earthquake, and part of this cliff falls. You can see a couple of loose rocks, and what that does is it brings boulders down to this area here. It's never been a safety issue, it's more of an inconvenience issue. They just come and they roll down. So what we've done to make it a bit more less convenient for the rocks to reach all the way to the building is put some of those big plants right there. And they just act as a little bit of a break. Now in the front here of the garden, this is sweet potatoes. And we have a lot of sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes are really easy to to pick up and weed. And right now, these are in the wrong location. The sweet potatoes are edible, they're great. We wanna have them in other places where we need low ground cover that's edible. So this area, what the maintenance task for this is to move all the sweet potato to another location. Other thing about this garden is uh, Althea's birth tree. This is a beautiful orange tree and it's a lovely, this is, 10 years old, we've pruned it quite a bit, but it's uh, still going strong and it's definitely the most sentimental tree we have on the property. So we try to give it always a lot of protection, a lot of love, and uh, every six months or so we weed around it, a, a good solid weeding and give it some nice um, nutrition and stuff like that. Technically, this avocado tree here, it's in the wrong location. It's, it, we could keep it here for a little while longer, but if it starts encroaching too much on Althea's orange tree, then we will take it down, you know, or at least take down some of these branches that are in the way so that they don't uh, encroach upon that. Final maintenance activities is weeding around here and carving the back area, keeping this passageway open because the more this is open, the better it is for airflow because this is where the recycling and garbage is in this area here. So we want to always keep a relative degree of openness here so that wind can blow through and then there's no odors or anything like that. And this is also where we have the bicycles parked in this area. All right, well, that's Garden F. Thank you very much. Aloha.